Hello everyone. Um, I am <laughs> I'm going to be doing a video today about uh, my playpen and I'm actually using a different camera so um, we'll see how this goes. This is like my actual camera camera. I usually use a flip video recorder and um, we'll see how this goes. I can't go over 10 minutes though <laughs> so I will try. So yeah, so a lot of people have been asking about my playpen and how we made it and what what it's made out of, all that stuff. So um, I'm actually whoops, sorry Harper. <laughs> I'm actually at home for for winter break. So um, this is my cage at home. There's the Ferret Nation, and here's the the barrier, and then my my bed's behind me. So there you go. That's what it is. Um, we put the barrier up so that um, they can't get into the closet there. And then my door is right there. Um, don't mind this monstrosity. <laughs> That's to keep Harper from jumping onto the top of the playpen. So thanks crazy Harper. <laughs> but um, we also don't want them to get on the shelving unit over there. So yeah, so it was actually um, just these these bottom boards before when I just had when I had Chiquita and Raya and Phoebe um, but now with Harper she can actually jump from the floor on top of there so we had to extend it so um, but all, all these are are these are pre-cut two foot by two foot boards that we got from um, Menards you can buy them at Home Depot and Lowe's and all that stuff uh, anywhere that sells wood um, and then we put um, hinges on them you you drill holes and put hinges on them um, in the dorm room um, they have the drilled holes like on the one side and they are zip tied together so you just use some zip ties right yep <laughs> I'm getting swarmed I'm playing with my camera strap anyways um, so yeah, so these are held together by hinges. The ones at school are held together by zip ties. And it's really nice because I can replace them or move them around as I need to. Um, so yeah, so I think, um, oh no, so then the top, the top boards are actually screwed on to the bottom ones. My dad's a, used to be a carpenter, so he's really good at that kind of stuff. Um, and then it is, the end board over there is screwed onto the cabinet or um, shelving unit over there, and then it's also actually screwed to the base um, or the the molding around the door. You can kind of see the the hinge over there. So it's just screwed to the molding around the door. So yeah, um, in this area, I actually have. A hinge. I'm not going to open it all the way, but this is actually a door, and it just okay. Let me get it back in. No escaping rats. Oh goodness. There we go. No escaping Harper. <laughs> she would too. She'd be gone. She'd be out of here. <laughs> but um. So yeah. So this this entire panel right here. Um, is a door and it just kind of swings out on hinges again. Um, so yeah, so that's how, but before when I just had the bottom boards, I didn't have the door. I just climbed over, but now since it's so high, we actually had to put the door in. So um, that's why this hinge is only on one side. It stops the door, stops the door from going, um, like it, it kind of makes it a one-way door kind of thing um, and then here we have um, a tile there um, it helps this board stay in place when I close this one it also covers a gigantic hole that Harper likes to chew so yeah um, I guess I'll say a little bit more about the place in itself um, as you could tell by this floor I just thought about it there's actually carpet on top of carpet and I don't have, I'll show you, this is actually my room, don't mind the clothes, 
Um, that's actually my real carpet, and then we just have this cheap carpet right there. So yeah, so this is the outside. I have those rat decals on it. But yeah, so there's another tile down there to keep this board from moving. And then, yeah, it's just... I have someone climbing me. Thank you. So yeah, so let me try and go all the way back here. You can see... There it is. So there is the the barrier, the playpen, or whatever you want to call it. Um, you can also use baby gates. I've seen people use. Um, you can get like playpens from the pet store, but rats can climb them. So I have found that the wood boards are really the best. They're really cheap, and they're already pre-cut for you. Um, this is, I think they were like two dollars a board or something. It was something ridiculous. And um, my dad cut some of them in half, too. Um, that's what the ones on the top are. They're just those cut in half. Um, but yeah, at school, again, they're just zip tied together instead of this. So if you have a drill of any sort and some zip ties and some wood, you could make a playpen. Um, they also, it helps if you have them like against a wall or something like that. Um, they're not really good for just like freestanding ones, but. Um, I guess you could do it, and zip ties are pretty good, but <laughs> they're pretty strong. So yeah, so there we go. So what do you guys think? You guys don't escape. Pippa, do you escape? No. Daddy built you a nice playpen. <laughs> so yeah, thanks to my dad. <laughs> it helps when you have a dad that can build things. Like, he also built that stair. <laughs> The stairs that come out of the Ferret Nation. So, that was nice. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys um, enjoy and hopefully you guys learned a little bit about uh, my playpen and how that works. <laughs> the rats are actually attacking the camera and you can't even see it. <laughs> here they all are. Uh. <laughs> so on that note, bye!